Hi Cancer, hi Aquarius. This is going to be a, um, a combined reading, but it's going to be separate at the same time. So these are the messages for Cancer for October, October 2018. Happy Halloween if you celebrate. Um, I hope that the month has started off well for you. If you're viewing it early, I hope it starts off well for you. Uh, thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. All of my information is below if you want to book a reading or just whatever, read about it. It's below. Thank you. Um, and let's get started. Okay, so five cards spread for October for Cancer. What's going on with Cancer? It's a general reading, so it will not resonate with every Cancer. But if it does resonate with you, great. Like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. the deck three of air talks about divorce separation maybe due to infidelity the the need to practice caution in a relationship you may be going through this or have gone through this cancer maybe with an air sign gemini libra aquarius eight of water is right where you are you are abandoning one one position one path maybe to focus on another so it's it's the eight of cups um you didn't allow yourself to get to the nine of cups here because you saw that there is not emotional fulfillment here for whatever reason but you're abandoning putting your emotions your time energy effort definitely emotion into a situation this is you right where you are patience waiting temperance finding balance in the waiting process finding balance within yourself knowing that there is better for you also getting back emotionally balanced because this could definitely have you out of out of whack you know off off center um obstacle is the four of earth it may be that you still want to hold on it may be that someone's still holding on to you it may be that you're still trying to hold on to a status or the status quo this may be trying to save face maybe you or someone else capricorn virgo taurus energy the obstacle could also be that um you're trying to maintain money status you're trying to build wealth here for our you're trying to hold on to some assets to whatever that may be uh what's helping you is the two of earth nice you're weighing up you may be doing a lot you may have your hands in in a lot in regards to work and finance you may also be weighing up two very real options for you um this is what's helping you you're getting to a place of understanding that A decision will be better to make than to keep following or just keep dividing yourself amongst what or who you really want there's two real options here sometimes this is the love affair this is the business um, deal that's not favorable How can progress be made? The four of water. Some of you are just failing to see that whatever you want, whatever you need is right in front of you. It's here for you. It's here for the taking. It's like you're trying to put your blinders on in, in, in regards to making this decision. You see what it is, a four of earth. It's, you know, 
this is a decision around your stability or what you've created for yourself thus far. Do I continue? Do I walk away? Some of you are walking away and, and are having divorce or separation from. Okay, let's jump into Aquarius and we're going to see how the cards either mirror or differ. Let's see, Aquarius. What's the general energy for Aquarius for October 2018? October 2018. Okay. At the bottom of the deck, the magicians is definitely different. <laughs> okay, so we have this is right where you are, Aquarius judgment. Judging a situation with a new set of eyes. Something has been risen from the dead. You you're looking at it. Do a, it's coming back around for you. Do you want this or do you not? It could be a relationship. You have the four of wands here. In a relationship is anything it could be romantic platonic business partnership relationship whatever you're judging it it's here for you and this is right where you this is right where you are and are you on your correct path the four of wands says you are focused on your stability focused on maintaining that thereof you may be focused on um, real estate purchasing home buying a home you may have gotten an offer here you have to judge it correctly um someone may have come back to, from the past friend lover this is you right where you are something is uh, causing you to have to look at your your what you've established thus far It's causing you to go deep in regards to is this working for me was this working for me was it working then will it be working now your obstacle the queen of pencils is making a real solid sound decision this could be about a business excuse me business partnership This could be about your physical health. This could be about your outer appearance. You may even be wanting to enhance that. Um, this might be, once again, in regards to real estate, um, the sale of or the buying. Maybe in, in regards to career and finance. I just keep hearing, am I doing this again? Am I doing this again? Whatever that means to you, Aquarius. Um, what's helping you is the page of pentacle so there's an idea there's a message that stability stability is elsewhere for some of you you know it is you have to make a decision you have to judge this correctly how are you moving in what direction are you doing this again How can you change your the focus here? Are you starting the business? Are you going to get more sound about business? Or the starting of a relationship? It looks like Aquarius is more focused on money than anything. What's helping you is the Six of Wands. You're getting recognition. It's a lot of positive recognition. There's some haters in the background of people in the black. Yeah. Um, Self-promotion, promotion, um, putting yourself out there.
acknowledgement, suitors, the magician is here at the bottom of the deck. You manifested this, Aquarius. You know this is what you wanted, but it's coming in a manner of making you have to be really grounded in, in your decision making. And not so aloof and detached from the outcome. You have to be strategic and logical to get here. To get that victory. This is what's helping you. You're getting that recognition. And you know that it's coming. You've manifested it. You have all the tools. You've done the work. You are doing the work. There has to be something sacrificed here. Something. Up. Are you doing it again? Are you going to do this again? I don't know what it is. Only you know. Are you staying at the job? Are you starting the business? Are you going into this relationship? Are you giving it a try? Or are you going to remain single? What are you doing? Okay. Alright, so let's get some advice here. If you have questions out here, here's the angel answer deck for cancer. The angel answer deck for cancer. Trust. Trust that. Trust your decision making. Trust that you know what's best for you in the near future. It looks like you know that you need to make a decision about something. You're weighing up the pros and the cons. You're not sure if someone will take to an offer. Um, you're not sure if this will work for you. You're not sure if this is a person for you. You need to trust. Uh, reconsider. Big happy changes. Nice. That looks good for you. Alright. And let's get some butterfly oracle cards here. For you. What should cancer be focused on going forward. In October 2018. Be true to you. Yeah, and that's a part of trusting, trusting yourself, keep the faith, changing your mind, looks like that did have relationship dynamics, changing your mind, relationship dynamics, dynamics, um, the dynamic of the relationship has changed maybe because you left, um, you're leaving, uh, you know how you feel about this situation, so now your mind is changing, grief work. And that may be where you are. Grieving this third party situation. Not seeing that this could turn around for you. That you can really have true happiness. Maybe with someone else. Somewhere else. Okay. Alright Cancer. Alright Aquarius. Let's get some advice here. Let's get some angel answers. So Aquarius. If you have questions out here. Here are your angel answers. What do you have to tell Aquarius? Romance. Ooh. The situation will improve. Not the right time. Within the next few weeks. So, Aquarius, it looks like for some of you, romance is on the table. Somebody is somebody giving you a gift here with the page of pentacles? Like the message of the message of stability. Like they're trying to show you, like, hey, I want something solid and stable with you. I don't know if they're giving you a gift. I don't know if they're giving you a lot of attention with the six of wands. Romance may be on the table for you. The situation will improve. It looks like once you make the judgment call, what am I doing here? The situation will improve. It may not be the right time to make that move, whatever you're doing, um, to accept an offer, uh, maybe on the sale of real estate, the buying of, or to put in an offer. Um, not the right time to restart, 
rekindle but within the next few weeks maybe you'll be able to make something happen because you are the magician here all right what should Aquarius be focused on welcome the new nice Aquarius heavenly signs all right. sobriety okay. okay these popped out of the deck healing from the past moving bottom of the deck memories So it looks like Aquarius, you have newness here for you, very much so. Maybe in the love sector, maybe surrounding your stability. Um, there's a small gesture of um, wanting to reestablish or wanting to establish something with the Page of Pentacles here. Heavenly signs. Understand that heaven is trying to speak to you through. Of different signs in your life that could be music that could be items that could be people you could be talking to people and the words that come out of their mouth it's like light light bulb effect um epiphanies heavenly signs are here for you sobriety understand that um sobriety is not always about the chemical influence of but sometimes it's about the mental and emotional influence where are you mentally and emotionally where are you becoming not unstable and um not in a sober mindset by way of maybe listening to someone or something or, or getting several tarot card readings or listening to tarot card readers getting psychic readings you're having the influx and the overflow of all of this you know perspective and information to the where you're not even thinking sober so it might be thought process and it could very well be um chemical influence also um maintain your sobriety by being around people who hold you accountable and sometimes it's going backwards and helping someone else maintain their sobriety too um healing from the past whatever that may be for you in whatever arena healing from the past, doing the actual work, writing things out. When you write them out, you can see them and you can change and shift the energy and the focus of to write out what happened to you or what you did. Yes, it hurts and you have to deal with it because you're now it's on paper and you can read it. But now you can then shift the focus and the energy by writing out good things. Um, and creating that spell for yourself okay so healing from the past however you do that with a you know a therapist counselor all of that is great moving some of you are moving away from yeah some of you are moving like like there's home buying um, this could be an actual physical move this could be a mental and emotional move I mean welcome the new and then moving some of you are getting new home new status memories uh, the memories keep you bound to a situation. The memories of the past, you have to heal from that. The situation will improve. Do know that. Okay, Aquarius, Cancer, I hope that this reading was magnificent for the both of you. Uh, all of my information is below if you want to get in contact with me to schedule a personal reading for yourself. Um, it looks good for the both of you. Just do the work, okay? Know that I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care. Bye.